Ahem. That is not what I meant to do. Get back here, you're in my dinner. Hershey, are you okay? I did not mean to stop paying attention long enough to make us fall. You good? You good, Hershey? Ooh. You're all wet now. But you're a good horse, you'll live. Note to self. Pay attention. on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You would think. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, <laughs> she has a wild look in her eye. To be fair. Of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? And Lord knows what they did to her. Back on her feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. We can only help. The O'Driscolls. You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, they're a bunch of assholes, from what I can tell. Them for years. Big gang, nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back, and not in a good way. A Why'd you stop? Few. Watch out, bear up ahead. Oh. Let's see if we can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. I mean, feel hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Now, Charles, you're gonna think less of me for this, but I want to fight that bear. I want to fight it really, really bad. And I feel like if I pull out... Off the trail. Okay, fine, Charles. We'll do it your way. It'll be fine. He will probably only attack us. Calm yourself, Hershey. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here. Ah. Uh, to be fair. Later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. It he is quite fair. different. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. You're not wrong. We need you now. Or never. Good. To be oh, fair. You've been with these boys. Why ain't you run off? Me? 
20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He, oh my god. Taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things. Him and Hosea. Huh. How fucking sure. old is Dutch? Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. I mean, seriously, how old fucking is Dutch I'll if you've been... He's all right. If you've he's been with him now. since he was a... You were a boy. I appreciate you me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> what man doesn't love his horse? I tried to ride the count once. Up me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. Huh. So the count, Taima, Brown Jack, and Hershey. Good old Hershey. Hershey is my horse. Brought some food back, boys. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, Hold on. Showing me how to use the boat properly. I only showed you a little. Come on, Hershey. There we go. It's not rocket science. You just got to be in the right place in the right time so that I can hit you. As for them, as for shooting a deer, it ain't that hard. The only time it gets really hard is when you fuck up. Just drop it down in here. There you go. What a surprise. Find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. He loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. You'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. <laughs> this really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. Burnt hand. Okay, so... Alright, got it. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna... Oh my god, that is graphic. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these... Sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <laughs> yeah. We're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Y you're going to drain it, right? Too. You gotta drain it of the blood, otherwise it's... Okay, yeah, I think I think that's what they're doing. I think they're draining it. Because you gotta drain the blood out of the alert. The autosave slot contains autosave old friends 3.8% saved on November 24th, 2018. At, uh, whatever. Yes, I do. You gotta hold it. You cannot just click it. A few days later. Been a bad few weeks. <laughs> Dutch. We're alive. Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Uh, 
You know. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here then? You know. Oh yeah. In these graphics, John looks a little bit like Daryl Dixon. For the moment, or Norman Reedus, I mean. He looks like Norman fucking Reedus. I think it's time for the train. Want me to go? Of course I do, but... Look, Ashley. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Jack. Abigail, young Good Jack. Good to see you, John. You see me now. What's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. Uh. Plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill. Nice to know that they've always had a good the relationship. Before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. Come on. What do you want from we me? was. I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, I feel like we will, though. Mind you, I just, I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What, what else is new? Have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Good He's question. Railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him? Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get I thought we already ready. made something of ourselves. We have a train to rob. Come on, Hor uh, Hershey. It's time to rob your first train. All right, I'm gonna let, let, let's let's do this. Compendium updated. White-tailed deer. Oh, sweet! There's a goddamn compendium in in this. When riding with a gang, double tap X to move up in formation, or double tap R to drop back. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the Odriscoll, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're going to pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. Oh, God. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Oh, Lane, God. Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You got it. Morgan Gray. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough. After Bill blows the tracks, we're going to need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yeah. Basically. Yes, boss. Good. I pretty much understand what the fuck I got to do. <laughs> You basically want me to do the important bit because I'm the main character. This game is fucking pretty. I tell you that. The fuck everyone oh they're back there. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of 
Vamos, hombre. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. Okay, well. No mistakes. Javier Escuela definitely sounds familiar, so I think I was right last time about him being in RDR2. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Mike? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. Money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. All right, Dutch. Stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money. Once we work out how to cash them. Has everyone anyway anyone come to the conclusion that this could easily be a trap? Like this seems a little bit too easy. And a little bit too convenient, if you ask me. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. 